All right, it is inauguration day, and we are going around getting the thoughts of all of the great hosts here at FM News Talk 97.1. I am wearing the inauguration day t-shirt, which we are giving away. If you're watching this on our website, you can probably click on the page you're watching on and register to win one of these shirts. If you're watching on YouTube or something, go to 971talk.com slash president. Register yourself to win one of these fancy brand new Inauguration Day t-shirts. Standing here with Mark Cox in your beautiful office. Thank you. They're hard to get, but yes. I've got mine right here that I'll be wearing. Today, yeah. I'm wearing my Donald Trump Mr. President I like t-shirt. It. I had I to like go it. to New York City to get one of these. These are kind of tough. Nice. Nice. Tough so, it's Inauguration Day. It's a big deal, obviously, here. What are your thoughts as the new president's Well, you know, I, I reflect back on my man Ronald Reagan here, and I was just looking at video of him earlier, and, and his, his swearing in, in in 1980 and again in 1984. What, what that did was create a sea change in America. It, changed, it, was a, it was a complete turnaround in how government approached the economy and a lot of different things. I think that's what we're going to see with Donald Trump. Um, I know there was a lot of talk before the election about how he was going to have a new approach, but I mean, seriously, uh, he's bringing in people who understand Wall Street and can talk about what regulations do to the economy. Uh, he's bringing in some military leaders who I think are going to take a different approach to fighting terrorism. He's obviously going to have a different approach when it comes to foreign policy, and I'm excited about it. I mean, it, he's taking a beating in the media, let's face it, mm -hmm. and uh, I, I think people, ha their concerns are overblown. I don't think there's any doubt in my mind that Donald Trump's up to this job, and he's going to do a great job. How quick do we see some change implemented? you think he gets to it? Oh, today, to tomorrow, first first week. Yeah. I think that he claims his first day is not till Monday, the twenty third, mm -hmm. but he's going to go to the Oval Office this afternoon or, or right after the inauguration, and he's going to start signing executive orders to reverse executive orders. So there will be some things we may not feel them immediately, but I think they'll be announced over the weekend. All right, yeah. all the coverage of inauguration day is right here. Mark Cox Show, FM News Talk ninety seven one.